Yo, what's up everyone? It's Carson Rock 35 here. Welcome back to another awesome episode here in Crazy Craft 3.0. Today we work on getting ourselves some Sky Strike armor and mess around with a little bit of the Doctor Who mod. Let's get right into it. Okay, everyone, so if you haven't already seen or guessed by the title and you don't know what's going on, you don't know anything about this show, then welcome, welcome to my amazing world of Doctor Who, if you haven't guessed. So today we're going to build a TARDIS here in Crazy Craft. Now, this is what I was talking about when I really didn't want to build a house, and this was something to do with it. And you guys will see why if you don't know anything about this mod or the show in the first place. So let's get right into it. First of all, we have these Contron crystals, Contron, Contron crystals right here in iron. We need these to make what it is called a TARDIS key. And a TARDIS key is what we're going to use to spawn us in a TARDIS. And if I didn't leave an L in front of my T for TARDIS, we wouldn't have the problem. So there we go. Look. So this is a TARDIS right here. This little blue police box. It's awesome, trust me guys. And then we have the Tardis key. So to make this, we need one Contron crystal and to make an L with iron. So which is no big deal, it's actually really cheap. Usually you have to find these really rare, like underground and whatnot. But I actually found four of them between the first episode, first couple episodes of exploring and whatnot and just overall. So it's actually really cool. So boom, we have that. We're gonna go ahead and put the rest of these in here because we might need more Tardises later. But you know, if, in all reality, we, we don't need another TARDIS. So, boom, let's go ahead and we're going to bring the TARDIS key in here. And I, I, is this tall enough? I don't know if this is tall enough for the TARDIS. Okay, so we're going to leave him. Okay, we can bring him in here for now. So, let's go ahead and just spawn him in. There we go. Look at him. <gasps> Look at this. Is it facing the wrong? Okay, no. So, here's the front entrance. Guys, the best thing about this. Let's go in. The best thing about this is, oh my god, it's so dark in here. I did not expect that. Do I have to, like, activate the lights? But look how much space there is. Oh, yeah, there we go. Let's activate console and turn on the lights and whatnot. Look at this, guys, and as it starts to fix itself. So, first of all, so, you might see what are these little doorways because they're just blocked off, but they have, like, a blue X here and a red X there. So, obviously, if none of you guys have ever seen the mod, you might be a little bit confused and if you've seen doctor who you also might be a little confused but it's all good so wait we got our sonic screwdriver right here we want to take this out and we need to configure this so let's go ahead and i gotta remember all the buttons on how to do this and whatnot because we have to configure it through here um yeah oh no wait wait did that did that take my sonic screwdriver give me that back give me that back okay so how do i reconfigure this again yeah shift click i can't remember Alright, there we go. So I have to shift, right click, and then we'll change it. So you see corridor, medium, dismantle, reconfigure, corridor, medium. That's all we have right now. I think that we can get farther on later on. But first of all, let's go ahead and let's just, look, let's click. I have to click it, right? Yeah, there we go. Right click. And we just get another corridor. So whatever it's set to is that's what we get. So let's make corridors on both these sides here, right? Okay, and then how do I get, like, a big room? Uh, that's dismantle? Reconfigure. How, okay, what if I just reconfigure? Well, that's not okay. Do I have to put something on there? How do I get like big room and stuff? So there's somewhere on these panels somewhere to, to change it. Ooh, here we go. Corridor, medium. Okay, big rooms, big chamber. Corridor lift, corridor junction. Corridor. Okay, so let's go big rooms, big chamber. And can I, is it on there now or do I have to? Okay, so it's on quarter medium now, and I think I have to put it in here, and then press the button, okay, then press it again, and then take it out. Yeah, big chamber. Okay, so we're good now. So let's come over here to this one, and let's right click it. Look at, look at all of this space. Don't have to build anything. No building, no lights needed to worry about mobs. It is just a complete space. It's our own little world and dimension. It is awesome. We don't have to do anything. It's so much nicer. We can focus on having fun in the mod packs instead of doing all the building. This is super cool too. I absolutely love it. So I want to have a bunch of these rooms actually because at some point I want to get dupe trees. But like these are so cool and it, it's literally infinite. You can make this as big as you want and it, it literally doesn't matter. And then also down here, if we come down here to check it out, you can see that we have buttons and whatnot that actually can be pressed. Everything can be pressed in here. Um, for the most part. So this is how you control I'm pretty sure experience and, and whatnot for actually moving the TARDIS because it can move throughout dimensions in the game. Uh, changing console's rooms may replace the box. Please wait and then she and then sneak right click this button to proceed. Oh, 
change the console room. Oh, full tentish. Oh, gimme, give gimme, give gimme, give gimme, give gimme. No, 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 no. Give me this one. How do I activate it? That button. Uh, please right click and sneak right click this button to proceed. Yes, right click and sneak right click. Eh, eh, eh. Yes. Please tell me this actually looks like Ten's TARDIS because there are multiple doctors who you do not know. How do I get back up? Actually, whoa. Hot. Oh, there's a teleport pad or something here. Do I jump up? Ooh, that's so cool. Okay, so it sort of looks like uh, David Tennant's TARDIS, but at the same time, not really. And I think just mainly because they recolor blocks and they don't restructure everything. Okay, so let's check out a different view for the TARDIS. I'm actually really excited about this. I'm geeking out. Uh, main, ten is that it? They don't have like Smith's TARDIS? Smith had two different TARDISes, yo. You don't have any? So what's just full? I don't have any other blocks, so yeah. Okay, so that's full, and then what's just main? What's main, then? Eh. That's interesting. Uh, I'm thinking full fills in the sides, doesn't it? And, hi -ya. Yeah, yeah, it does fill in the sides. Okay, that's actually really cool. I like that a lot better, uh, just for now. And we can always change it later on. And we can also, you know, actually redesign this place if we want. We can do that all if we really want to. We can recolor it and everything. I don't remember how to. It might be with the Sonic. It might be with placing blocks down. That's something we're going to have to figure out overall. But, okay, we need to make this our big, big armory. That's kind of my idea. So all the armors and whatnot we collect through here, this is where we're going to keep them. So this is actually going to be super cool. So I want to kind of make a corridor or whatnot. So let's see what else can we build with this because this is going to be super, super cool. Let's go ahead and check out the other ooh, display rooms. It's on this side. So rooms, corridor lift, corridor junction, Okay, so what other rooms are there? Medium farm, ooh. Medium chamber, library, ooh, what's a library? Give me a library. Yeah, we'll put that in here. Um, actually, can I take that out now? Yeah, there we go, we can just put it in there. And so let's make, li let's go to, the let's go this way. Let's go this way to the library. Okay, library, boom. Ooh, this is cool, look at this. Ooh, are these, I think, if I remember correctly, yeah, multiple stories, look at this. This is actually so sick. I love it. Oh, wait, I can go up again. Okay, and I can go down one. And I, let, I can make more corridors. That's fantastic. So, okay, so look. Oh, there's actually a information guide here. So, menu. The flight. The TARDIS is a capable, primary, extraordinary feat. I know what all this is. Uh, and I sort of know how to use it. But that's really cool. This is... Ooh, wait, crafting. Craft what? For all your convenience, nearly, nearly all the TARDIS's companion systems can be made using the block transfer mechanics built into the TARDIS. However, for the few that cannot, great care has been taken to ensure that they can be manufactured with natural materials. For more temporary active materials, the temporal laboratory can be used to transmute ordinary materials. That's really interesting. Uh, I haven't looked too far into everything, and yeah, there's flight and everything in the console, because it's like a mini game when you fly the TARDIS. You don't want it to explode, because it can't explode on you. That'd be very, very bad. Okay, but with all of that, I want to go ahead and continue on with everything else that we're going to continue doing this episode, and that's all where, that's where we are. It. That's it for the Doctor Who mod for now. That's where we're going to be living, basically, and that's why I don't care about building a, a, a nice, fancy house. Okay, so next, what we're going to go ahead and do here is I actually need to keep this in the, the TARDIS, so I don't remember. But while off camera, I did a lot of traveling just so I could find a flipping cactus, and I finally found one, and I started running back here as fast as I could so I could record this, this little episode here. And so now we can make what we call Miner's Dreams. And actually, no, we still need one more thing, and that is going to be a good old simple gunpowder if I remember correctly and that means we have to kill a creeper which should be super hard but at the same time it's not going to be nice or fun or easy at all so yeah gunpowder oh I meant to type in miners dreams dumb me miners alright so boom and yeah there we go so gunpowder redstone blocks and cactus so okay let's go ahead and get a redstone block going Four, five, six, seven. you know what? we could just take a bunch of redstone it literally doesn't matter there we go and then boom we put that back in there and now let's get some more cactus 
cactus. Let's get a couple stacks of that. There we go. So now let's go ahead and let's get my sword and start grinding out some gunpowder because I think it, there should be mobs outside. I would assume there are mobs outside. So let's go for it. So boom. And there we go. Let's go ahead and let's see if we can find ourselves a creeper. There's one literally right there. We're chilling. That's absolutely fantastic. Okay, let's take this guy on. This is not going to be easy, especially since he has 80 health and we only have a diamond sword. We really don't want him to explode. I have not gotten any gunpowder yet, which is very, very uh, confusing how I haven't since I've killed a bunch of creepers. The house looks so danky, but it's protected. <laughs> And we live inside another dimension so we're chilling so crafting table here let's go ahead and build ourselves a bunch of redstone blocks so we don't have to worry about that at all um i'll actually get all these up here boom there we go that's a stack of redstone blocks now we can go ahead and just come up here let's store everything else away get the gunpowder in our system there we go in a gunpowder and we want just a single stack of that perfect and now we need to craft miners dreams which we have i should i need to put a there's a butterfly in my house i need to put a crafting table upstairs already that's what i really need to do so boom make this there we go and i think this is gonna be the easiest way to split it up yeah most definitely boom and boom there we go we have evenly done it all about for the most part here and we actually have one extra that's what we come down to that's really interesting that we have one extra of each cool there we go now we have a ton of miners dreams and we are chilling we don't have to worry about anything at all so um beauty fly or butterfly you, you just go i'll take you more so let's put all of these in here now we're rocking with miners dreams we're gonna put a couple in here uh, because they're actually decently in C value and we want to keep them. But what we need to do next is make our mine. Because the whole point of all of this is so we can get Transformium. Because Transformium is extremely hard to find. And we actually need to get on it as fast as possible. Let's go ahead. Oh no, there's a Caterpillar. That's not good. We got. That's why we built our house in the sky-ish. And in another dimension-ish. So let's go ahead and start working our way down. Do I not have an actual mine? Oh, I do, but I don't. I need to get down as low as possible. Okay, guys, so we are at the absolute most perfect type bedrock here. We need to be as low as possible, and let's just, let's use it. Okay, um, I have two staircases here, so I hope this doesn't mess with either of them too bad. Boom! Oh, that didn't touch it at all. That's absolutely fantastic. So if you guys have never seen Miner's Dreams before, they literally just create this little tunnel and gets rid of everything that's not uh, a resource so we leave black iron iron everything that's not stone gets to uh stays and everything stone really gets deleted i should have said that not the way i said it. i should have said backwards when i said it because that would have been so much easier on my mouth and ooh, plenty of sapphires but we're looking for transforming now only a chunk of transformium uh, or a single uh, section of transforming can spawn in a single chunk. And I think this is it right here. Is this it? Please tell me this is it. Yes, it is. Okay, so this is it. So only one of these per chunk, these uh, ore selections. I don't know how much it can be up to. Uh, I think this one's four and only four. And we're going to need a lot for transformer armor. And that's going to be... Oh, wait. Well, I mean, they could be different chunks. Oh, well, I don't really care. This just makes it easier to find. Perfect. I'm just really glad that we've got some. Because we're going to need a ton of this to be able to make some Transformer armor. And outside of just Sky Strike, it'd be nice to have them all. It'd be a nice little collection. So, we definitely need a whole, whole lot of this. But we can work on the others later. Right now, we just want to focus on getting our boy Sky Strike. So, we can fly around and go boom, boom. Because he also gets missiles. So, that'd be a great defense, hopefully. I really hope that, you know, obvious explosions do a lot of damage. And they're not going to be weak or whatever. Because that'd be, ooh, titanium. Really, really disappointing, if so. But these guys only uh, smell into nuggets and that's so disappointing um are these real diamonds diamonds are just great emc and that's why we always want to pick them up yes thank you i'll gladly take a whole nother section of real diamonds it's beautiful oh and there's another one there coolios and another one i am in shock hold on i need to build up i need oh i don't want to get rid of black iron black iron's actually extremely good for things later on like computer parts and black panther and everything else uh those we will want to get at some point just not right now because that is for hulk that's gamma radiation blocks and anytime you pick it up you get dead 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 you get radiation and i see a spidey over there which i am not excited about fighting but we might have to uh hi spider 
Uh, we're just looking for simple. Oh, ow, 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 ow. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. You can't do any damage to me. I mean, he can't. That hurt a lot. But we can go ahead and get three more transforming that we have here, which is fan flippantastic. For a full set, I'm pretty sure we need around 26 or something. And yeah, that's definitely not going to be a good task because we are at currently 14. So, guys, I will see you when we have the rest of it. Okay guys, so we have plenty, and I mean plenty of Transformium and other resources at this point. As you can see, I've got full Amethyst Leggings. That mine makes it so easy to get resources, and because of all the resources we found, we are up to 2.1 million. EMC so we're chilling out with EMC now and all of this armor is better than diamond I mean the helmet alone gives me two armor points and then boom put everything else and the sword is 15 attack damage Jeez, it's insane but we need to get working on our sky strike armor and what we need for that mainly consists of iron and transforming but let's see what else we need to find uh, we need some ink sack still that zip, there, there's a dog Oh yeah, I forgot I have dogs. They're sitting outside. Oh, hi, buddy. I, I forgot that you guys were out there. Okay, um, ink sacks, bone meal, rose red, not that big of a deal. Uh, yellow glass, not a big deal. A lot, and I mean a lot of iron, apparently. Holy crap. So Okay, so let's get working on some ink sacks, yellow glass, red dye, bone meal okay so bone meal shouldn't be too hard we have any bones stored up or any red flowers no i do not see any at all okay so let's go ahead and check the emc table first so i'm pretty sure we would have bones in here at some point considering we just spam stuff in here okay yeah this uh we'll just take a stack of bones that's plenty of bone meal and rose red or red anything nope we just have red stone so we need yellow and red flowers interesting out and i just lost all that extra hp which i i don't completely understand how the hp system in this game works for modded but i mean we get life and we lose life and that's yeah that's something all right in this 15 attack image sword is so nice it's it, 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 spiders run away no, what all right Red ink, yellow flowers. They shouldn't be too hard for us to find, but overall, hey, look there, right here next to a disgusting little creeper. You're gonna go in the water. Ow, that hurt. Not really. He only did a heart and a half. So let's grab some flowers here, and then boom, perfect. Now we, have, since we have an EMC table, that is all that we need. Oh yeah, I forgot. I have kitty cats too. Yeah, that's no fun. Oh my god, my house is so pitiful. I, I, I don't care though. I love having my darters. I don't have to worry about a house. And oh, you got on top of the furnace. Don't burn your little booty there, bud. Okay, so now that we have all the bone meal and all the flowers and everything that we're going to need, we should be all right. First of all, let's just go ahead and repair everything in the EMC. So we added it. So boom, bone meal. Get some uh, red and yellow dye in there. Put the red. Thank you and yellow will be fine for now okay so what else do we need while we're waiting for the rest of the transforming to smoke what we really need would be oh, freaking squid ink squid ink that's so so annoying squid ink uh well we have oceans right out over here so i think we're gonna make a little direction we jump this way and see if we can find any squids hey and they're right here there's some squiddy squid squids all good in the hood as long as they're not attack squids if they're attack squids we're in trouble um are those ducks beating or this squid up or is he drowning and oh that was raw squid Ugh. remind me of attack squid oh yeah the ducks are definitely beating up it looks like the ducks are beating up the squid but that's fine. Hey, and there's an ink sack. Easy peasy. Now we gotta head all home. And we should have everything else that we need to be able to make this up. And uh, there's a beaver. Yeah, there's the beaver around here. I'm just glad that the caterpillar that we saw earlier is gone. Because he could have left cobwebs everywhere. Okay, guys. So we have the glass smelting up right there. So we can make the yellow glass. And we have everything else we need in our inventory. So we are chilling all there. Let's go ahead and come up here and get a actually we need a crafting table up here i'm tired of this so we're gonna go ahead and do this where is my wood uh here is some wood we're gonna bring a crafting table all the way up here so i don't have to do any of this bull crap of climbing there we go boom and let's make ourselves a nice crafting table there we go that is beautiful it's amazing lovely astounding so what do we need to start off with first of all let's go ahead and make the let's make all the transformer actual armor so let's go ahead and do that first of all make the head thank you and the boots easy peasy 
let's go ahead and make the leggings next as you can see we got plenty of transforming it wasn't as rare as i thought it was going to be but it was still eh like it was like less than diamonds but more than iron uh, no i would say less e less or equal to iron it was really weird it wasn't you know super common it wasn't super rare either okay so ink sacks we have three of those we're chilling there let's go ahead and boom uh i need more iron so let's go ahead and iron out of our emc table here um we're gonna make sure we store one of these ink sacks too so we don't have to do that again so boom actually let's just pull out a stack of iron so we don't have to worry about it there we go now we can make our helmet here so a iron on top with our face plate in the middle and then our two things on the side boom sky strikes head that is amazing okay so next would be the torso Okay, so we need two AHD2 jet wings. So we need a transformium and four iron to go with that. Okay, so we need two of these. One, two, and boom. Boom. Easy peasy. There we go. There's two of those. So next we need to make the the cockpit. So that's where we need the yellow glass for. We also need three iron blocks. So let's go ahead and make those real quick there we go and let's go ahead let's check down on the glass downstairs it should be done by now i would assume yeah it's done smelting perfect go ahead and come right back up here now it's glass round die not die around glass to make glass die, uh, die glass right oh thank god because i didn't want to do the other way around perfect so now we can make our torso for the most part so boom let's go ahead and make this so we need the three iron blocks here glass and the iron ingot boom there is our cockpit perfect next would be our actually we have to actually make the torso so we need bone meal red dye and the jet engine jet engines are two more iron blocks and a redstone so okay so let's first of all let's go ahead and grab a, honestly let's grab a little bit more iron here because i think we're gonna need it and then some redstone as well red stone and perfect okay right, now we have plenty of everything that we do need let's make uh and we do have bone meal perfect so let's make do we need uh four iron blocks in total right so that should be plenty if we do it like this there we go and four perfect that's all the iron blocks we should need so next let's continue to make the torso jet engines here oh we need iron bars as well so we need two iron bars actually so that's boom 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 there we go so now we can put the iron bars here with the blocks as well the redstone and the iron ingots and that should be everything that we need we need two of those perfect and i think that's everything we can actually make the torso now perfect okay red uh bone meal there and there give me that the cockpit here the transformium torso jet engines the rose red and then finally the hg2d rings whatever they're called boom now we have the sky strike torso that's awesome okay leggings up next not that hard at all so we just need a bone meal there redstone here a couple pieces of iron easy peasy and then our transformium leg outline there we go and what is next and why oh okay it's because it's two dies like why is pink dye popping up because it's just two dies okay so now we need to put the bone meal up here and we only need two pieces of iron as well so that was really easy to finish off actually so the hardest part of that was the torso which wasn't hard at all and guys we officially have our sky strike armor let's put this on one by one oh my god look at the little head it gives me that's insane okay what about the feet okay the feet don't even think legs oh my god look at the, look at the little, little chicken legs look, look at the little chicken legs oh my god and then we finally put on the torso look at that high flyer beautiful so how do we transform again i need to go over my control okay guys so apparently transform is my numtad three and oh look at that look at us go everyone we are flying about okay so yeah w is to accelerate we are accelerating and then numpad two to use nitro nitro Whoa, look at us go. But Okay, but I have to fly with my looking. So I'm going to have to fix up my keys later on if I want to be able to use it. But that's so cool because that means look. So now we can just go ahead and like come up here, right? We can slow down and time it right. And boom, there we go. We, now we can come up here and fight these guys and actually be able to get pets and stuff from up here. So let's just take this and boom, an iron golem pet. That's actually really cool. What does he give us again? temporary shield ooh, and he likes iron nuggets so it's not that hard either 
Oh, look at what? We get a jump boost with him? Yum. And bye bye. Wait, button two to shoot. What do you mean two? Like this two? I, oh, yeah, we don't have any rockets. That's something we have to actually build and add to him. And oh my god, look at all the mobs outside of my base. That is insane. But guys, I think that's what we're going to call today's episode. Let me know what Transformer or what superhero we should start off with next time. Anyways, I hope you guys all did enjoy. Leave a like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you all later, Rockstars. Peace, peace.